Hello everybody, Caleb here with Slide Edge Journey day number 30. Yes, the big 3-0, almost done with the first month. It is feeling insanely good. I feel like every day I'm learning more about myself, I'm learning more about what I want to achieve, what goals I want to get done. My prioritization uh, is a lot better about what I need to get done each day. Um, so, for example, today I got up relatively early. Um, not too early, but relatively early. And got done with uh, packaging for the online store. Then I went in straight into doing some homework for my communication class I had today because I needed to get that all done. Um, that was pretty interesting. It was a who am I a little survey kind of deal. Not really a survey. The identity checklist kind of thing or identity list um, is very interesting I feel like I learned a lot more about myself and some of the things that's going on in my life and I've already been doing that in these 30 days but it was pretty interesting to think about some of the, the questions and topics it had me write like top five things for myself on um, but it was pretty cool got that done felt really good to get that done because I didn't want to not get that done before class today but I got that done uh, after that I went to the chiropractor because my neck and back were killing me these past couple days and it's just been getting worse um, cause it started happening like two weeks ago but it's progressively gotten worse and I couldn't handle it anymore so I went to the chiropractor bomb feel pretty fixed up probably gonna try and go next week too though because still feeling a little stiff back there um, not really stiff, but it still feels like there's something that needs to get fixed. It feels way better though. Anyhow, got back home, ate some breakfast slash lunch, brunch as they call it. Uh, had a chicken sandwich with avocado, with tomato, and bacon. Not a chicken sandwich, it was a chicken patty and heat up in the microwave, but with avocado, bacon, tomato. Mm, that's one of my favorite things to eat. Super healthy, super good stuff. Probably be better if I didn't use the microwave on the chicken patty, but I'm kind of lazy and it's efficient and fast and uh, I got the other healthy stuff in there. But anyhow, then I got to go to Costco with my mom and girlfriend, just trying to get some new black slacks for uh, some of my outfits because I don't have very many pairs of those and I need more, but they didn't have any in my size, so we had to order some online. It's the kind of whole reason we went was a fail, but got some other cool stuff. Got to look around, got to just have some fun in Costco, got to try some samples, pretty cool stuff. Um, other things though, after I got back, went straight to class. That uh, was fun, class is always cool. My teacher's super fun. Uh, got home, relaxed for just a little bit, ate some food, uh, took uh, a little bit of just relaxing time. And then got into some reading. Got around, I think, 45 minutes, 50, 45, 50 minutes of reading and listening done in Way of the Wolf. Super, super good book. Gave me a lot of good things to think about as I'm trying to grow my business. Uh, it's been very interesting. Um, very, very interesting stuff to read. More than halfway done. Probably going to finish it, hopefully, by... This Sunday, this coming Sunday would be good. You know, maybe try and get it done. May not try, we'll get it done. That's the motto, no excuses. You gotta make things happen. Can't wait for things to happen. You gotta be proactive, not reactive. You gotta keep your eyes laser focused on what you wanna get done. See through the eyes of time, as the slide edge calls it. You gotta be able to live in the moment, but see the future that you're building. Kinda makes it easier to see where you're, where you're heading and remember why you're working so hard. Um, but yeah, after I got done with that reading time, relaxed for a little bit and then got into 10 minutes meditation. That was super good to just relax, kind of gather my thoughts, um, become a little bit more present in the day and leave all the stress that I was kind of building up behind and kind of just getting ready for all the things I want to do tomorrow, get some planning done. Um, well. Not really much planning done while I was meditating, but it kind of gave me a good time to refresh my brain. Um, after that, though, got to go in 
and eat a parfait, have some yogurt with some sliced fruit and some granola and some chocolate chips. Been on a super kind of health craze lately, trying to get my weight up, trying to help inspire my dad to get his weight down because uh, he could be a little bit lighter, I could be a little bit bigger. We both have our own goals, but overall, I think a healthy lifestyle is beneficial for overall energy, overall uh, prevention of disease, and a whole bunch of other stuff that I'm learning in my nutrition class, which I think is pretty cool. Uh, it's helped us a lot in kind of figuring out what foods are good to have in the house, what foods aren't good to have. But besides that, after or while we're eating our parfait, we got to watch some My Hero Academia. Pretty cool show. Both my parents are liking it. Um, that's been a lot of fun to kind of share with them. And I'm hoping they'll keep enjoying it. It can get a little weird at times, but I think it's just most anime gets a little weird at times. But what can you do? Um, overall, the story's pretty cool. It has a really good main character and some really cool side characters and good messages and whatnot. Really enjoy it. Um, hopefully they're really enjoying it. Then my sister and her fiance had a random stop in while we were doing that. So I got to talk to them for a little bit catch up and see what they were up to and talk to them. It's overall pretty cool stuff. And I came back out to my room around uh, probably like 10 or 9.30 or so and got done with stringing a tennis racket for an old buddy of mine because he dropped that by a couple days ago and I hadn't got it done. So I was like, I need to get that done today so I can get that back to him by tomorrow or whenever he's free to pick it up because you know don't like to keep people waiting you gotta take it spend your time wisely and get as much stuff done as you can every day because not tomorrow or not tomorrow tomorrow isn't always guaranteed so gotta live like it's your last uh, gotta make sure your legacy is what you want it to be at all times that your reputation is what you want it to be and just gotta keep striving for greatness gotta be on that slight edge uh, slight edge curve to success it doesn't need to be like this it's like this but then after a while it starts picking up take off you know it's cool stuff slight edge is good that's why I'm giving away a copy giving away a copy of Think and Grow Rich hopefully put out the uh, next chapter episode tomorrow or the next day that's like the longest chapter in the book organized planning so that might take some planning to get that out and done uh might need to be a two-part video or something, maybe. That'd be crazy. And make the episodes real hard to keep track of. Who knows? Um, but yeah, that's it from me for day 30. Overall, really productive. Day 31, going to be just as productive. Going to kill it. And that's it, though. Hope you all had a great day, too. Uh, if you could leave a like, I'd appreciate it. And if you don't, uh, it's whatever. Thank you for your support anyway, if you made it this far. I always appreciate that. Um, Leave comments if there's things you think I could do better in these videos or explain more what you want me to talk about or maybe things I could not talk about because sometimes I feel like these drag on too long. Like this one is, like I said, thank you for your support and peace.